featuring four teams this season. Nine man football has been around at the high school level here in Alaska the last two years. For one program, it's helped them become one of the best teams in the state for the entire league. It's given the game back to a school that once thought it to be impossible. Let's go, let's fight, let's On a field that houses one of the most successful programs in the sport, another team is starting its own ascent. In back-to-back -back years, the Seward Seahawks are officially state champions, defeating the Nikiski Bulldogs this past weekend, 36 to six. <laughs> Only this time, the style of play is a bit different. Seward and Nikiski, along with Monroe Catholic and Valdez, now competes in nine-man football, a version of the pigskin that has its own unique aspects. Yeah, numbers don't matter anymore, so there's a little bit there. So yeah, it gets a little bit weird. You got to make sure your kids know online, offline, all that stuff. That's important to know. In the standard 11-man format, offenses and defenses line up in situations like this, with six linemen in a variety of skill positions. But in nine men, those linemen essentially become the skill positions, with the spaces usually reserved for your left and right tackle now becoming assignments for your tight ends and receivers. And with two less players to take up space, that leaves plenty of room for the playmakers. But this style has done more than just provide running room. It's also established these schools as gridiron programs something that originally was quite the challenge. Uh, we have 17 kids and they have 19 or 20 kids. And when we take, play teams like Kenai or like Homer or um, all these other teams that have 60, 70, 80 kids in their program, um, there's just a point where it's not, it's not feasible to do anymore. We don't have subs, we don't have those kids. You know, I'm asking freshmen to go play a varsity football game and, and that's not the right way. And now the benefits are beginning to show, especially for the athletes. It was definitely hard to adjust having those like tackles or tight ends being eligible receivers and stuff and figuring out different blocking assignments and um, but it's a lot more open space. I'm pretty fast and so it kind of suits my playing style. And I kind of thought it was interesting. I didn't know what to think about it until we hopped in it and I don't know it just felt felt great. It's a unique concept, one that's set to provide more opportunities for Alaska's youth and forge memories that'll last decades. I run track with these guys, I play football with these guys, and it's just to be able to, to play here with every them and have this moment and win with them. And I'm just, I'm so grateful for my brothers and to have them here today. Family on me, family on three. One, two, three. Family!